For as he thinketh in his heart, so is he. When you see a man is small, he is small because he is thinking small. When you see a man is big, he is big because he is thinking big. You cannot think like an ant and end up like an elephant. For as a man thinketh in his heart, that means that the responsibility of your heart come in life has been handed over to you by your God. That capacity for determining your outcome in life is activated by your thinking. The way you think is the way you live, is the way you act, is the way you behave. And how you act and behave determines how you become. And how you think is expressed in your mouth. From the abundance of the heart, the mouth speaks. From the language of a man, we know what is in his heart. And what occupies your heart determines where you occupy in life. So think big. You cannot think beggarly and pitiably and live kingly and prosperously. Life is a function of the heart. If you must be the king of your world, you need heart, heart, heart. There is a heart you need to succeed and to exploit. There is a heart you need to command exploits. Exploit is not for the feeble or chicken-hearted. Exploit in life is not for the weak-hearted. But exploit is for the strong and courageous.